Hi everybody, welcome back to the nursery. Had a few things I want to show you. Um, I had been wanting to get one of the pillows that the, little, that the babies lay on and just kind of snuggle on. And I finally got me one. It's in the shape of a lamb, which I just love little lambs. And uh, so I wanted to share that with you guys. Um, I think, where did I pick this up at? TJ Maxx, I think, is where I got it. Um, for $16.99. I didn't think that was too bad, so I went ahead and got it. I really love the lamb. Um, and also, I wanted to freshen up the nursery. Um, I have gotten, I did get some new bumper pads in. Really love the shabby chic look, and so the old roses just really appeal to me. Um, so it's got the pinks and some blues in it. Um, and it's got this nice paisley print on the crib sheet, so it's a good contrast with the roses. This is the little, um, it's like a little quilt that goes in here. So it's got that print on one side, which, and I'm going to show you, and it's got the little fuzzy on this side, but that print matches or coordinates with the bed skirt and the, the valance on the window. So you have the roses up here and the smaller roses also and then you have the paisley and then you have the blue so I'll zoom out so you can see um, the crib skirt matches with the um, the back side of that little blanket that the throw or whatever you call it so and it's got the little paisley is it back can't tell if I'm zooming out there we go and now it's moving okay but anyway it's just a just a little change in the crib. I was just wanting something different, so I did find that on eBay and um, decided to go ahead and get it. Just freshening up in here a little bit. Um, I will. I still have some things that are not quite in order in here, but it's kind of we're working on it. I'm just wanting to change some things around. Um, did kind of create a change in table area. I just have this little chest in here, so I decided to put the uh, changing pad on top of. And then above it is the little diaper stacker that matches the set. My husband put up a shelf for me so I could put some things up there. And those are those are two things that were hand stitched, just cross stitching that I framed. And uh, my best friend's mother did those. And... Uh, I really love those, so I left them in here. I really love that rocking chair one. Um, here's the balance I was talking about. It matches the set. It's um, the same blue pattern that coordinates with the um, the little crib skirt and the back side of that comforter or a quilt. Um, yeah, there's a slot in the end here. You can open up and kind of stuff it and make it puffy. I haven't done that yet. I just kind of put everything in here today. I was kind of looking at it. I hadn't done that part yet, so we, we'll see how that works out. Um, <clears throat> so it's just an update. Um, yes, the, the nursery is empty right now. Um, baby Joel and Bethany have been adopted. And they are safe and sound in their new homes. Um, I'm just kind of going through some things something that I have been wanting for a while so I'm working on making that possible um, so it's just kind of my personal preference you guys and I loved my babies and I've had several silicones but you can only have so many at a time you know space wise and also they're expensive so I've just made some hard choices of something that I really want and I'm working on getting that as we speak so there will be some announcements, but it is going to take some time as this is not an overnight process by any means. Um, so be patient. There will be more to come. Um, some more exciting things and um, happy for the two new mommies, which really love Joel and Bethany. And I'm so happy to spread that. You know how it is when you get your babies and um, you're so excited about them and so it's exciting for them to get in touch with me and tell me how exciting they are or, or how excited they are about it so I was really joyful about that and um, it's good times y'all good changes on the way and real I'm really excited about it so for now we're just going to enjoy the nursery tour 
Um, I'm going to straighten up some more in here, you guys. But Oh, and I do have a little, one of the little, what is it, the stickers with the writing. I bought a little poem to go in here. I'm going to hang up. I haven't figured out where I want it to go yet. So, but this is just kind of a glance around the nursery as to what's going on. Still some things that need to get done up and I hadn't done yet, but I'm still working on it. My daughter made me that wreath, and yes, it's hanging way too high, but there was already a nail, and I just hung it there. I'm going to take it down and um, rehang it somewhere. Um, she made this in honor, well in memory of a daughter um, and that was her favorite colors pink and green so she made that for me and it's got the little butterflies on it and uh, so I wanted to put it in the nursery even though it doesn't match a single thing in here but I love it and I'm gonna try to get it and reposition it on the wall so it's not crawling up the ceiling so anyway that's really pretty and I appreciated her taking the time to to make that for me it was it's very special all right, you guys, thanks for joining me, and um, we'll be talking with you soon. Bye-bye.